So this isn't exactly the video that I planned to do today. Um, I went through two other ideas before I hit this. I was going to film a men's fragrance review with my husband, but I don't think he was really feeling up to it. Um, then I decided I was going to try to, sorry my dog is down here. Um, then I decided I was going to try to do a scenting the Olympic Games <laughs> video um, and I made some headway on it but I was having a lot of trouble like finding specific scents that I thought with specific that I thought fit with specific games and I was just starting to get too frustrated with it so I just put it aside um, I did come up with the descriptions for them and stuff um, and uh, my husband came up with one who was like oh yeah cross-country skiing something that lasts a scent that lasts forever but it's boring <laughs> and it smells the same the whole time no offense to any cross-country skiers out there anyway so i just decided to do something really quick and simple and share with you what i've been wearing a lot lately i haven't really been doing a whole lot lately so i've just been kind of grabbing things that are easy and that that i enjoy and that kind of make me happy so um i have a couple of body sprays because uh, I do like to wear these at night and when I go to the gym um, but I've mostly been wearing these at night lately and the first one I have is Ulta Sensual Kiss Amber in Woods this is really good for for what it is I mean it was really inexpensive Ulta is cruelty Ulta's store brand is cruelty free so that's always nice um yes yeah, Sensual Kiss Amber in Woods it's got a it's a very comforting scent for me and I really like it it's got that sweet ambery scent um, maybe it's got some floral in it too i think and as it dries a little bit it's got a lot of woody notes that start coming through so and the other one the other body spray i've been using a lot is the brazilian crush body fragrance mist from sol de janeiro um, this is very sweet sweet scent um, it's to me it smells like coconut pistachios and caramel it's so good I love the way this smells it does not last long I know a lot of people complain about it not lasting long but it's a body mist let's be real it's not gonna last long it's a body mist anyway I've got this little mini rollerball of Midnight Flare from Nest that I've been using a lot lately I do have a travel size spray of this um, this is a really really wonderful evening scent um, I do have an overview of this whole brand if you want to check that out um, look at my playlist you can, you can find it in the fragrance sets playlist anyway um, this is a fantastic evening scent I've been wearing this when I feel like I want something a little bit more special. Okay, next I have Marrakesh from Mark. Uh, this is a really, really nice floral oriental. It's a sweet white floral oriental scent, and uh, that, that's about it. It's a sweet white floral. It's got it's um, got lots of spices and amber and cardamom, and it smells really, really nice. So I have been going for this one lately because it's it's like a happy scent for me so and another comforting one I have the Christian Lacroix Ombre and I've been wearing this one a lot as well this is also sort of an a floral oriental but it's not quite as heavy as Marrakesh and this has got a little bit of a caramel note on the dry down as well I'm sorry it's not an oriental it's like it's a it's stated that it's a cheaper gourmand so yeah there you go there is some citrus in it but it's not super tart citrus um, so it's got some nice florals in it some amber and woods in the base and like I said it's got that caramel note as well so yeah um, I've been kind of stuck on um, a minuscule rotation of fragrances lately. I don't know why. These are just the ones that have been kind of making me feel good. So that's what I've been wearing. And I just thought I'd share that. So um, that's all I've got for you today. Um, if you are new here, please subscribe. It really helps me out a lot and it means a lot to me. And until next time.